What is going on everyone? It is Fatal, Reaper Day, bringing you a video, and today we're on Fortnite Season 5, um, and we just jumped right into it, and we'll go ahead and jump right into it. So before we start this video guys, be sure to hit that like button and subscribe, it really helps me out and I really appreciate it, so let's go ahead and get into the video. So today we're going to be going over all the new changes in Season 5. Now I've got a pretty big list here, it's going to be a lot to cover, so first as you'll notice the uh, whole void little thing in the middle, this is the void uh, little split you can jump in uh, it will basically be like a rift and just throw you back out if you hit it it will also heal you which is weird but uh, pretty cool and of course the first place we're gonna land on here and this is some of the map changes and everything is salty tower so our good and old tilted towers is kind of back in a smaller way but I honestly have to say it brought so much nostalgia to jump back here and just have the buildings back um, it was just it was just incredible to be seeing that again because Tilted was my favorite place to land as it, I'm sure it was everybody's um, But it's really cool to see there's a bunch of new map changes in the entire game uh, We're gonna be going over all of those and everything like that um, They did let's go ahead and talk about some of the things they vaulted so they did wind up vaulting the pump uh, Sadly the tax shotgun is back. They brought the double barrel back. They've brought um, the uh, regular regular SMG uh, they kept the silence system SMG they took away the fire trap the revolver the epic scar boogie bombs epic burst rifle uh, rocket launcher and tack SMGs so tack SMG was my favorite so I kind of was pretty sad to hear that they let that go but you know that's not that big of a deal I do have to say it's kind of fun having the tack back once again um, and the charge shotgun is back now as well and they did remove the combat shotgun as well, which I'm not too bad about, but uh, I wish they would bring the pump back. I don't know why they keep taking away the pump, but, you know, I do have to say this update's pretty pretty good so far. I'm having really a lot of fun with it and everything. Um, so they've added a lot of new map changes that I'll be going over in this video, so, you know, be sure to stay tuned, watch the whole video. There's a bunch of little map changes. Um, they've added plenty of stuff, definitely back, so obviously Salty Towers is basically tilt the towers back. We've got, in a sense, uh, with all this kind of sand stuff going on, uh, you can actually, if you sit in the sand too long, you can actually go up under it and then, like, uh, basically just dig through the ground and keep going and then hop out. It's kind of it's kind of cool. Um, but that being said, we got a new place, too, um, coming up. There's a desert coliseum. There's a place called Desert Pancakes. And I didn't visit every single spot in this video um, but you can go look that at those for yourself and everything so they did add a lot they added a uh, razor crust or crest razor crest excuse me it's a, a ship that is landed on the map and then they've added actually flush factory is back in the corner of the map in a little bit of a way it's not fully back kind of like salty towers we don't have the full tilted towers but it is there slightly nonetheless so, um, the next place we're going to be hopping to here is the Coliseum. So, this new Coliseum is pretty cool. Um, I thought it was anyways. Um, I'm pretty sure it's just uh, the Desert Coliseum is what it's called. You'll land there, and there's also a boss there, kind of like with the agency and stuff. The agency is no more, if uh, you guys didn't know. The agency is completely gone and everything like that. Um, so... I landed here. I didn't get to kill the boss. I wound up getting pushed, but there is a boss there you can kill, and I'm pretty sure he drops, I'm sure, a weapon, wonder weapon, or wonder weapon. What is this Call of Duty? But uh, the AK is back, too. That's another thing. The AK and the heavy assault rifle is back, and I do have to say the AK has been, I've been dominating with it here lately in a few games. Um, I keep playing over and over. It just, it's hard to get back in the groove because I haven't played for so long, like, competitively or actually played, played, just ba basically doing videos and stuff like that, but it, it's been so fun to get back into play it and everything like that. Um, uh, again, guys, this, I am on my regular PC, so it's 2070 Super and everything like that, description down below, um, if you're wondering what I have. Um, we're not on the uh, pavilion as of right now. I will be doing a video later on on the pavilion, but um, we are here at the Desert Coliseum on my regular PC And like I said guys the changes they've made just pretty Pretty cool. I mean, I've, I've liked it everything um, I do again miss the pump. I wish they wouldn't have vaulted the pump again But I do like the tack shotgun. I can't say that I hate the shotgun uh, and I do kind of like the charge shotgun But I my I myself would rather grab the tack shotgun and everything like that 
Um, so this next place we're landing here is called Stealthy Stronghold. Now this is ripped straight out of Jurassic World. It has to be like it's literally straight out of Jurassic Park or Jurassic World. There's literally a raptor cage right there that I go to here in a second. It's it's literally a raptor cage. I mean it's if they weren't doing that, I don't know what they were doing. But it's actually really cool. I really like the um, the new map uh, new map locations. There are honestly really cool, really creative. Uh, there is an underground facility to this as well as there would be um but yeah here's the raptor cage and everything and that, you can't tell me that's not a raptor cage um but i just wonder if they'll bring dinosaurs in later that would be actually kind of that'd be kind of dope but uh anyways yeah guys there's a lot of map changes a lot of things going on they've done um and taken out uh but all in all i have to say great update i have I've, I've just loved it to be honest to be back onto it it's just fun to play again brings back that sense of old fortnite a little bit a little bit more uh, especially with uh, Tilted coming back and all the new skins, the Battle Pass and everything. New Battle Pass is amazing. They're even at, talking about adding uh, Master Chief to skins uh, later on. There was a leak, as far as I'm aware from what I've read. So do look out for that. If you're a big uh, Halo fan, you'll be getting a Master Chief skin. So there's that. Uh, again, there's a lot of more new locations on the map that you can go see for yourself. And the things that I pointed out, I may have missed a few things. They've added so many things. It's hard to keep up. Um, but... Uh, like I said, they have added a uh, new uh, kind of like flush factory. Flush factory is back a little bit. This clip right here, I wanted to show you guys too. This shark legit just hopped on the land and was, I guess he's a sand shark. He just hopped on the land. He was all the way here in the middle over here at Risky uh, Reels that they still kind of have in a way. It's Most of it's destroyed. But, um, and he was just literally trying to attack me. And he was literally just sitting there in the middle just coming at me. But I thought it was pretty funny. And then he went back to the water. But, uh, I, of course, the sharks are back. Of course, the worst thing imaginable. These sharks are back. So, there's this, also this new place over here. It's kind of like a underwater. It's like an Atlantis place. City of Atlantis, in a sense. Um, it's really cool. I landed here and got around the place a little bit. Um, it was pretty fun to land. It was pretty, uh, what they did, I, like I said, in this update, they've done so many creative stuff. The, the new place the map locations are just ridiculous and just looks so good and uh i remember the 100 percent what the name of this place was <laughs> but um it was really cool to land there it's kind of like got a coral reef and stuff like that going on so again like i said they're very creative with what they've done the shark cove is over here again as well in the corner uh little place you can land uh it's also the prison right there if you guys notice that's kind of like the prison um, that you used to have over there by Moisty Meyer. Oh, good old Moisty. I wish they would bring Moisty Meyer back and I would be, uh, flipping over everywhere. But, um, yeah, all these new locations are really cool. It's called Coral Castle. There's the name of it. Forgot all about it. But, um, so they've added a lot of new map locations and everything like that. But, guys, that's pretty much the video, and I hope you guys enjoyed this. Be sure to like and subscribe uh, if you enjoy my videos. Uh, I'll see you guys in the next video. If you have any uh, questions or want to see more on Fortnite or anything like that, please comment down below. And, again, be sure to like and subscribe as always, and I'll see you guys in the next video.